Hello, dear students. This is your engineering mathematics three lecture. Today we are going to discuss few examples on Poisson distribution. In previous lecture also we have discussed Poisson distribution in few examples. Now here again we are going to discuss few examples on Poisson distribution. Poisson distribution. This topic is from fourth unit probability and probability distribution. Okay. You see the example. In a Poisson distribution, if probability of R is equal to one is equal to twice probability of R is equal to two, this equation is given. Then find probability of R is equal to three. Okay. So using this equation, you first find the value of Z, and then you can find the probability of R is equal to three. So here we are going to use Poisson distribution. See what is the formula for Poisson distribution? P of R is equal to e raised to minus z into z raised to r upon r factorial. This is the formula of Poisson distribution. Now here this equation is given. P of R is equal to one is equal to two is P of R is equal to two. Now when P of R is equal to one, you put in this formula R is equal to one. So the equation it reduces to it is equal to e raised to minus z into z raised to one because r is one upon one factorial. Again you find P of R is equal to two term because here in this equation the term is there. P of R is equal to two, so you put in the formula of Poisson distribution R is equal to two, and so the formula it reduces to e raised to minus z into z square because R is two. E raised to minus z into z square upon two factorial. This is the step. P of R is equal to two is e raised to minus z into z square upon two factorial. Okay. Now this. Uh, Equation this relation is true. P of R is equal to one is equal to two into P of R is equal to two. It is given. Now you put the values of both the terms. P of R is equal to one is here. E raised to minus z into z upon one factorial is equal to twice P of R is equal to two. See what is P of R is equal to two. E raised to minus z into z square upon two factorial. Now you simplify this term. Here E raised to minus z. Is uh, present on both sides, so it will be get cancel. E raised to minus z, e raised to minus z. Then two factorial upon two, sorry, two upon two factorial. It means it is equal to one because the value of two factorial is two. Two into one, two. This two numerator two and denominator two get cancel. E raised to minus z on both sides will be get cancel. So in LHS the term is z, in RHS the term is z square. So z is equal to z square. This is true only when z is equal to one. The square of one is one. The square of number is equal to that number itself. It is true for only z is equal to one. So the value of z is one. Now put in the formula. Now, sorry, what is our aim? Our aim is find probability of r is equal to three. Now this is the formula of probability, Poisson distribution. P of R is equal to e raised to minus z into z raised to R upon R factorial. In this formula, you put R is equal to three. R is equal to three. R is equal to three, and z is equal to one because we have calculated the value of z also. It is one. So here in this Poisson distribution, put R is equal to three and z is one. So e raised to minus one because z is one. So e raised to minus one. Z is one. So one raised to R the value of R is three one raised to three upon R factorial R is here three so upon three factorial now e raised to minus one into one cube one cube means one upon three factorial three factorial means six and e raised to minus one so we can write this term in denominator so after simplification the term is one upon six e one upon six e if we calculate the value using calculator it is zero point zero six one three so this is the probability of when R is equal to three. So this is the example in question distribution. Next, again there is one more example on question distribution. The accidents per shift in a factory are given by the table. Here frequency distribution is given. Accidents per shift, zero, one, two, three, four, five. The values for accident per shift are given. Observation and the frequencies for these observations are given. It means that zero accidents are there. Yeah, one forty times in a shift. One first shift, one fifty eight accidents. 
shift to 67 accidents and so on. This frequency distribution is given. And you have to fit a Poisson distribution to the above table and calculate theoretical frequencies. This is your question. Fit a Poisson distribution to the above table and calculate theoretical frequencies. Now, how to calculate the theoretical frequency using Poisson distribution? Here we have to first fit a Poisson distribution. To fit a Poisson distribution, we want the value of mean, means the value of z. Here the frequency distribution is given. So using the formula that mean is equal to summation fx upon summation f, you can find the mean of the frequency distribution. We have discussed it in third unit statistics, how to find the mean when frequency distribution is given. The formula is summation fx upon summation f. Summation fx. F into X, you construct the table uh, and in that table you construct the column F into X. These are the values of X and F. You construct the column F into X and then in last you do the total Sum summation. That is will be the value of summation FX and it is here 398 upon summation F. Summation F, addition of all the frequencies, it is 400. So if we calculate the value 398 upon 400, it is z is equal to 0 0.995. So this is the mean value of Poisson distribution here. Okay. Now we have to fit a Poisson distribution. So formula is here P of R is equal to E raised to minus z into z raised to R upon R factor. Okay. Now uh, the value of z is fixed. It is 0 0.995. So put z is equal to 0 0.995 everywhere. Okay. Now here, we want to find the probability distribution, Poisson distribution for every value of x. x is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So put r is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And you find out the probabilities at every value of x. Suppose r, this is p of r formula after putting the value of z. Now put r is equal to 0. r is equal to, suppose x. And the values of x are here 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So r is equal to 0. We put here in this formula r is equal to 0. And calculate the value. 0 factorial is 1. And 0 0.995 raised to 0 means 1. 3 raised to minus 0 0.995, its value is 0 0.3697. Then put p, sorry, r is equal to 1. Probability of r is equal to 1. In this formula, put r is equal to 1. Calculate the value. This is the probability. 0 0.36785. Then put r is equal to 2 in the same formula. Calculate the value. Put r is equal to 3, r is equal to 4, r is equal to 5 in the formula and you calculate the value. So these are the uh, probabilities at x is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. Here the formula is written in, the, in terms of r but for this example we have given the observation in the form of x that accidents per shift, the variable x is given. So that r is equal to x and the values of x are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So you find out this probability that x is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So this is a probability Poisson distribution fit to the given data. Now calculate the theoretical frequencies also. So the total frequency summation f, it is equal to 400. Summation f means addition of all the frequencies. It is 400. So you multiply every probability term by 400. Means P of 0, probability of R is equal to 0 into 400. R is here, R is equal to X here in this example. P of X is equal to 0 into 400. Uh, the probability of uh, X is equal to 0 is here, 0 0.3697. Multiply it by 400. So it is 148. Again, P of 1 into 400. P of 2 into 400. P of 3 into 400, P of 4 into 400, P of 5 into 400. And you calculate the values, you get these frequencies. These are nothing but the theoretical frequencies for the given frequency distribution. The given frequencies are the exact frequencies. And uh, these calculator frequencies are the theoretical frequencies from, uh, we have calculated these theoretical frequencies from the probability distribution, Poisson distribution, okay? So here, the Poisson distribution 
Poisson probability distribution topic is over. I have covered all types of examples on Poisson distribution. Thank you. This session is over here. Thank you.